Brent, Sarah, there was a lot of emotion from those in support of this bill, which would prohibit no-fault evictions. Connecticut's eviction rate has risen 8% overall, with no-fault evictions up 22%. This morning, renters and housing advocates lobbied for the bill to protect tenants from being pushed out of their apartments. Right now, only those 62 years and older and people with a disability are protected from no-fault evictions here in Connecticut. Renters gathered and spoke about their experiences, hoping to appeal to what they say is lawmakers' moral duty. We have families who are suddenly homeless for reporting mold infestations that are making them seriously sick. How many more workers, families, and entire towns will be displaced in the next three weeks alone? Now, there has been pushback on this measure from some local landlords who say no-cause evictions are an important last resort tool for them. This bill was voted out of the Housing Committee in the legislature back at the end of February, but has not yet been brought for a vote on the floor. Advocates today hoping lawmakers will consider this bill with just under three weeks left until the legislative session ends. Sarah Brent, 